What's going on, motherfuckers? <laughs> it's always awkward. You know what I used to do, like, a while back, like, when I first started streaming, like, I started streaming in January 2020, and back then I only did game streams, I didn't do any talking streams yet. I think it took me, like, a couple weeks, like, a few weeks to start doing talk streams. Yeah, I started off with basically, I think, no, I think I did, no, god damn it, my memory is so hazy. You know what? I think my first live stream was a talk stream. And then after that, I started doing a bunch of game stuff. And then sprinkling in talk stuff. I don't know why. Gaming is just so much easier. It really is. Uh, yeah, but I remember I used to... Before I would start a live stream, I would get drunk before the live stream would even start. That way, when, I, when the live stream started, I would just like, boom, on. But then I realized there was, like, a huge downside to that. If you're already drunk when the live stream starts then your live stream doesn't last anywhere near as long as it could or should uh so it's better to start completely sober so your live stream lasts a lot longer uh but the uh double-edged sword of that is you start off sort of just like awkward as fuck because i just i'm just completely awkward like this <laughs> Chaco, what's up man arbos how you doing how you doing how you doing? Is that offensive to anybody? I have no idea. Oh. Is it Italian? <laughs> Anyways, um, got these beers from Belgium. I think I've had like one Belgian beer, and it was like some cheap ass stuff. It wasn't like fancy or anything. I don't even know if these are really fancy, but uh, if anyone's interested, you can find these things on the internet. Unless you live in Europe, then you could probably get it there or whatever. I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's called Lindemann's, Lindemann's Beer, I guess. And it's like these different fruit-flavored beers. I don't know how many they have, but these are the ones I have. I have... It says From Waz. I don't know what that means. Like some kind of... Uh, fuck, is that like ra raspberry? This one's like apple and cherry. I don't really like cherries, but I'm sure it'll be fine. And then Cassius. And I don't know what the fuck this is. I have no idea. No idea. It's got like a different language on it. No idea. It's like some kind of golden fucking thing. I have no idea what this is. No idea. I can't read any of it. It's all it's all in some other does does Belgium have its own language? <laughs> I don't know. If you were if you were to ask me, I would say, "Oh, this is this looks like German or some shit, but it's definitely not German." I don't know. I guess Belgium has its own language. I would assume. I would assume uh Starlight Smoker. What's up, man? Oh, you gotta go to court? Show me the one with the gold foil? I don't know if you can really see it that well. No idea what this is. Got a naked lady on here. You can see her butt crack. You can see her butt crack on here. That's pretty cool. Uh, Maybe that's the one I'll start with. I have the website for it. I don't know jack shit about this stuff. Like Lindemann's. Belgian brewery. I'll skim. I'll skim through it. Southwest of Brussels. Produces lambics. What the hell's a lambic? You guys want to tell? If anybody here knows what a lambic is, I'm not gonna bother looking it up. Uh, that's because that's a whole nother Wikipedia page. Belgian ale, raw wheat, yeast. Start 1822. Okay. All right. It's like a family company, I guess. I don't know. Uh, da, 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 da. Method of spontaneous fermentation. Don't know what that means. Do, 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 do. I'm, just skim I'm just skimming through here to see if there's anything that I need to know. Because I actually don't know what to expect. I'd like to know what the hell it is I'm drinking. <laughs> These are very weak, though. 
Very weak. I didn't realize that because I didn't look. 2.5%. What the fuck? And, like, the other ones are, like, 3.5%. That is the weakest shit I've ever seen. It's a good thing I still got plenty of whiskey for the next stream. Fuck. I'm basically just, like, trying these out because it looks cool, I guess. <laughs> All right, let's uh crack one open, I guess. Lambic is a type of beer with wild yeast. It changes taste even in the bottle, but it takes months. Really? How much do they cost? I like a few hundred yen each. They're not, I wouldn't say they're cheap. But then again, I don't, Japanese beer isn't cheap either. I mean, these are definitely, these definitely cost more than Japanese beer for sure. Definitely. Because they're imported. But, uh, it's a, uh, yeah. I don't know, probably, they probably do cost way too much, I think. But, I don't know. Probably something I'll just try one time. It's it's one of those things. There's so many things that I've tried where I just said I'll try it once, and then I say like, "Hey, that was uh, that was all right. That was pretty good. Not good enough to buy over and over again." I've, I've had plenty of things like that, and then of course there's things where I try it and I go, "Yep, that's a regular." Uh, this one, we'll we'll see. I don't know. I'd have to say probably not because it's it's not very strong, and you know me, I like the strong shit. I like to get riggedy riggedy wrecked, son. Alright, I gotta figure out how to open this shit. Just like gold foil and crap. <laughs> In the fuck. Alright. Anything that prevents me from drinking faster is already, uh, uh, already losing points here. What in the fuck? How do you open this? Look at this shit. That's not cool. Um, maybe I'm doing this wrong. Some kind of flap somewhere. Uh, maybe? I don't fucking know. I, yeah, what the hell, guys? Not you guys, the people who fucking made the bottle. And what the hell to them? I can't open this. Normal bottle opener. Oh my god, that's right! Do I have one somewhere? Where did I put it? Ah, here we go. Here we go. All right, we're in business. We're in business here. Yeah. I'm probably gonna be drinking gold flakes then, right? Or not? I don't fucking know. Hope none of it fell in there. Ooh, it's got some like smoke coming out of it. I don't like how it. Those flakes are around there now. How am I supposed to fucking drink this? <laughs> Alright, I have no idea what this is supposed to taste like, but, uh... There's a Belgian beer I drink, it looks the same. Really? You can open it with a lighter? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, you can do that. Definitely do that. I don't have a lighter, though. Uh... Yeah, they're not, they're not strong at all. Alright. Kampai! Whatever the fuck that says. Let's try this Lindemann's beer. These are all supposed to be fruit flavor. I don't know if this one's fruit flavor. The other one's a fruit flavor, but I don't know what this one tastes like, so... Let's get it. Yeah, they are cold. I just got all of them out of the... I just got all of them out of the refrigerator. However, they've been sitting on my desk for like 20 minutes. 20 to 30 minutes, so. Not as cold as they were 20, 30 minutes ago. But cold enough. Cold enough. It's funny, like every time I try to set up a live stream, I think I have everything set up. And then when it's time to actually go live, I'd be like, I'd be like, I'm like, fuck, okay, I got two minutes left. I got two minutes left. What the fuck? I wasn't paying attention to the time. And then it's like, and then like, I'm like, oh shit, I forgot to do this. Oh, I forgot to set this up. Ah, I gotta change my camera setup. I gotta change the music. I gotta, I gotta change this and that. And it's like, oh, I gotta load this. Oh no, this needs an update. Ah, fuck. <laughs> like, like, I'll try to like open Streamlabs and like, oh, it needs an update or some shit. Like, fuck you. <laughs> yeah. It's like, or my computer's like, my computer's like, oh, it's gonna crash right now. Sometimes my computer will just straight up crash. <clears throat> oh, 
buy Belgian dark ale beers next time 10% what in the fuck I think I saw a 10% beer on, on a website that's actually where I got these um I don't know I've, I don't pay attention to this type of stuff in the stores in the liquor stores I don't know if they're actually in there because I didn't see I actually got these off a website uh you probably you guys probably know it Yodobashi which I know doesn't make any sense. Doesn't make any sense. Yodobashi is supposed to be like an electronic store, but you can get the shit on their website. I never saw it in the Yodobashi store. So I wasn't looking for alcohol, so I don't know where the fuck they are. You know what? The last time I went to Yodobashi, I think I did see an alcohol section. I didn't see it before. I think it's new. I don't know. I've, I haven't been there that many times, like, to Yodobashi. Yeah, you get off the website and shit. Yes. Is Japan the same as Scotland? Like, over here you can get any alcohol at any shop. I... Don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Are you saying, like, anybody can sell, like... I don't know. I really don't know how you would get a license here. Anyways, I should probably start. I'm sitting there drinking like half of this one. I need to start opening up the other ones. Let's see. Which one should I open up next? Raspberry, apple, cassis, or cherry? I don't like cherry, so I'm going to open up cherry next. That's, that's my logic. I don't know if anyone else has that logic. Things that I like more, I save for later. If there's something that I don't like as much... Oof. Like when I'm eating food, I tend to eat my vegetables first. I hate vegetables. Don't like vegetables. Save the best for last, exactly. In America, it depends on the state. Yeah, that, America's so gigantic. It, yeah, it's completely different. Like, you just have no, I just have no idea. Damn, there's like red powdery shit from the foil. Hope I don't fucking die or something. I don't know. This is very, uh, very dumb. <laughs> I gotta sit there and like, I can't stick my whole mouth out. I gotta like sit there and it looks like I'm kissing it. It's not a very smart design. Yeah, as far as cherry goes, it's uh, it's all right, it's pretty good. I mean, these are all super weak as fuck, but I have five of them, so that should help me. That should help, right? There's five of them, cause uh, I'm just trying them all out right here for a short stream, and then I will finish them uh, starting up the uh, Yakuza stream. Just take the foil off. I'd be here. I'd be here a lot longer if I had to sit here and peel all that off. Plus, it looks like it leaves some kind of sticky, some kind of stickiness after. It's like, yeah, that's terrible. I'm just gonna press my mouth up against it. And these aren't very big. They're like 250 milliliters, so they won't. And they're and they taste really good. They won't last long. Uh. I don't know, I think this one might be better than the gold one. The gold one, I have no idea what the flavor's supposed to be. I, I don't... Oh, it's peach! Really? Because it's in Japanese. On the back, it says peach. Rindemann's peach. Okay. I'm guessing that's what that this is. I'm guessing this is supposed to be like Belgian for peach, I guess. There you go. When is the Yakuza stream? It's supposed to be in two minutes, but obviously that's not happening. <laughs> uh, it's directly after this one. After this one's over, that's when I'd be starting that. That's when I'd be starting that. What am I, a pirate? Yar. Oh, shit. God damn. All right, let's uh try this 
from was whatever the fuck from was means is that french <laughs> Oh. Belgium has four official languages. What the fuck? Is one of them German? Oh. Yeah, they gotta stop with that foil. I agree. Ooh. Don't know what to get a store yourself. Well, what is it that you're uh, trying to do? Are you trying to get drunk? Are you looking for snacks? Food. I say snacks and food is a separate thing because, uh, because, uh, I consider snacks different. When I say, when I say I'm gonna go get food, that means like a proper meal. You know, like, like burger and fries or pizza. I don't know why those came to my mind. Tacos. <laughs> Didn't say it had to be healthy or anything like that, but, uh, a meal like a full-on meal like I'm hungry snacks though like that's a totally different thing that's like that's just me just munching on shit for no reason I don't really have any snacks for the stream I just got I just got like a uh, beef jerky with that fucking giant red penis nose and there's some I already ate half of it though like on the last stream I still got some in there. Yeah, I, I kind of figure like the snacking is kind of not good. If I snack too much, like I'm already drinking and, al and alcohol is very, very high calorie. So uh, the snacking is just overkill. Got to keep the snacking to a minimum. Got to gotta have the uh, self-control. You want to get wasted. All right. Flavored vodka sounds good. Yeah, like, I don't know, it depends on what it is, I guess. The only flavored vodka I've ever had is Smirnoff, and those are very weak. They taste good, but they're weak. And they're kind of overpriced, I guess. Absolute vodka, I don't think I've had that. Yeah, not yet. If it's not on this channel, if it's not on any of my videos, I haven't had it yet. I'm pretty sure I haven't. I'm 99.9% .9 sure I haven't had it. It's Swedish. Hell yeah. Okay, French, German, Dutch, Flemish. What the fuck is Flemish? That's a language? And it's probably, there's probably like a hundred languages I've never heard of. Too many. Like, like Africa is a gigantic fucking continent. I wonder how many different fucking languages there are in the entirety of Africa just an insane amount probably like you, you just like you like you travel like 10 kilometers to the east and you have no idea what these people are saying you're like what the fuck they're like my next door neighbor I don't know what the fuck they're talking about <laughs> like imagine living in a place like that holy fuck Oof. like it's just it's like a weird frame of reference there like like America so gigantic but in there are different like dialects like regional dialects you know like people speak differently but they're all still speaking english you know so you can understand them pretty much 90 percent of what they're saying uh but then like you live in europe and it's just like you got all these different languages they're all so close to each other africa speak english french or african yeah yeah, that's true. There's a lot of English. A lot of well, yeah, Europe's the same way. A lot of English. A lot of English. English, mate. Um, and you get to Asia, and it's a uh, it's it's a uh, wild assortment. You don't really know what you're gonna get. Um, let's see. What do I want? Cassius, maybe. Let's try the Cassius. You know, it's funny, I said these things are weak as hell. They're weak as hell, but I'm starting to feel something. I don't know if that's just because I'm drinking them very quickly. Maybe. Or I haven't eaten any food in a while, so I guess I'm on an empty stomach and maybe it's like getting absorbed pretty quickly. Yeah, let's get some Cassius.
Ooh. I like that one. So far, that one's my favorite. Cassius. Which I've had Cassius before, like different ones. Uh, yeah, I'll pop out the whiskey for the Yakuza stream. What, um, like, I'm not gonna finish these on this stream. I'm gonna keep drinking all of these. They're all mostly halfway finished. I'm gonna keep drinking these at the start of the Yakuza stream, and then I'll break out the, uh, break out the, uh, whiskey. So I got something on Discord or something. I have to check that. African, they estimate 3,000 languages. What the fuck? <laughs> That's too many. <laughs> I know the country's big, but it's not that big. That's just overkill. <laughs> You're about to get riggedy, riggedy, riggedy wrecked, son. <laughs> oh, bad. Wait, let me see if I can... Turn this on here. Ay ay ay. Wait a second here. Uh, is this gonna get, is this gonna fucking blast me? Is vegan here? What what is vegan? Like no animal products. No animal product. You so you go your life just eat leaf. Why you don't know how to enjoy life? No vegan product. Go away. Go away. <laughs> go to other restaurant. Go eat your lettuce there. How how are people vegan? Vegan don't know how to enjoy life. Crispy pork is the best thing in the world and they want to eat spinach. Hiya. Vegetable tastes like sad anyways. Don't eat vegetable. <laughs> that made my night. That's... Oh man, I'm gonna have to download that later. Oh, how have I never seen this? This should be a, this should be a viral YouTube video. This should be a massively viral video that I should have seen already. I'm gonna watch that again while I open this apple beer. Do you have anything vegan here? What what is vegan? Like no animal products. No animal product. No animal product. You go your life just eat leaf. Why you don't know how to enjoy life? No vegan product. Go away, go away, go to other restaurant. Go eat your lettuce there. How how are people vegan? <laughs> vegan don't know how to enjoy life. Crispy pork is the best thing in the world and they want to eat spinach. Hi ya. Vegetable tastes like sad anyway. Don't eat vegetable. Vegetable tastes like sad anyway. Don't eat vegetable. Oh, thank you for that. Thank you, Arbuz. Oh my gosh. I don't know if you guys. I don't know if you guys could hear that. If I, hopefully the sound was. I was playing it over my uh, computer speakers, so hopefully that was uh. Be able to hear that. He's got a lot of views. Uncle Roger. Oh, I have heard of that. I've seen lots of uh. Lots of people reacting to him, a uh, guy named o Uncle Roger. But I just seen thumbnails in the titles. I never actually click on those. A lot of Japanese, a lot of Japanese YouTubers react to Uncle Roger, like the Japanese YouTubers who can speak fluent English. Those are the ones. You got you got this trend now that for the last several months, everybody in Japan suddenly knows about Filthy Frank, even though he's been gone for like four or five years. I don't know. And now suddenly Japanese people are aware of Fulty Frank. Like you got all these like uh, you got all these Japanese YouTubers who speak like pretty good English, and now they've jumped on this trend for a while where they put Japanese person reacts to Filthy Frank's blah blah blah, and it's just like wow, his Japanese is pretty good. Where's he from? He's from Japan. He's Japanese. You can't tell. <laughs> Wow! Is wow! So everybody, so I've been told he was born and raised in Osaka, Japan. The Japanese is pretty good. Of course it's good. <laughs> of course it's good. God damn it! Japanese people are fucking weird. And he like, like you sit there and tell you sit there and tell a Japanese person, I'm I'm full blooded Japanese. I was born and raised in Japan. <laughs> like like, but if like. But if you like, you like, grew up somewhere else, I guess. I don't know. They treat you like a freaking outsider. Asagi's life. Oh, God. Oh, boy. That's a channel that blew up. <laughs> I was subscribed to her when she had, like, I don't know, a thousand subscribers. And now she's like, pfft, I don't even know how many subs she has because I don't watch anymore. Her, her channel basically just turned into a... Uh, 
dime a dozen reaction channel. Which, you know, whatever works for her. But she she got really, uh... Yeah. She's the type of Japanese person I probably wouldn't get along with in real life. Yeah, she's, she's very, uh... <clears throat> I don't want to say anything to come back to me, because she might find out about it later. Don't tell on me. <laughs> but I don't, I don't have anything against her. I just, I don't think we're the, I don't think we're, uh... On the same wavelength, personality-wise. So I kind of stopped following her videos. This is like, I don't know, sort of fell off of me there, like all those reaction videos and and like the filthy Frank stuff. I thought like, oh, she don't think this is hilarious, and then she's like, kind of like grossed out and offended by his behavior, the things he says. I'm like, oh, come on, that shit's funny. You don't think that's funny? You think it's gross and dumb? Like, oh, come on. I like the kind of women that are just like, I like the kind of women that like fucking laugh at that kind of stuff. That I think that shit's hilarious, but she didn't seem to really understand the appeal. So I was like, nah. She seemed to be offended by him more than anything. And then like she got really upset about she her 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 clip or I guess her thumbnail was was featured on that trash taste podcast, uh, the anime man and. And those other guys, <laughs> those other guys, uh, yeah, they have like that podcast and they were talking about the big blow up of all these Japanese YouTubers reacting to like Filthy Frank, reacting to Abroad in Japan. And they're basically kind of taking the piss out of them, making fun of them a little bit, how it's very low effort content and they're all just sort of copying each other and not, not really adding the, anything of value, n nothing unique. It's just sort of... A very simple repetitive format and they used one of her thumbnails as sort of like a template like, like yeah this is one of them this is one of the dime a dozen and she reacted to their comments on 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 her video and she was very upset like to the point of like almost tears she was very angry very upset and she just couldn't she couldn't take it in stride and i just like at that point i decided like no nah, i'm done with this channel <laughs> it's like like come on like it, it, too uptight, too uptight for me. Hmm, Apple. Oh, that's good. That's good. Apple and Cassius would definitely be the top two. If I had to rank them, Cassius, uh, Apple's number one, Cassius number two. Oh, uh, boy. And then the other three, I don't fucking really know. I don't have very good uh memory, so they're all they're all fucking good. What am I talking about? They're all good. Yeah, I don't know why I don't know why people take all their shit seriously. There's this other Okay, so like I I know I took the piss out of her right there, but she still seems like an okay person. Um, but there is one Japanese reaction channel that I just absolutely despise. Uh, his name is like, what is it, like, Ryu React? Oh my god, dude. <laughs> uh, he's literally the anti-vlogger. Who's, who's the anti-vlogger? Oh, like, Sea Dog or Anime Man? I don't know. I have no idea. Um... I'd say I'm the anti-vlogger. It's literally in my it's literally in my drinking with Johnny songs, worst J vlogger in the world, because I barely do J vlogging anyway. Oh, filthy Frank. Yeah, filthy Frank. Uh anti-vlogger. <laughs> There's this one guy. He's like a Japanese guy, and his English is good? But obviously there's a really thick accent, and he sort of talks like he's got, like, jizz in his mouth. Shut up, cat! Are you serious? Whoa! Shut up! Alright, I'm gonna have to go see what the fuck he wants. Food?
I'm just gonna I'm just gonna leave the door open. I usually keep it closed, but I'm just gonna leave it open so if he comes in here he's gonna go raw 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 But at least I can pick him up and then he'll stop he'll shut the hell up if I pick him up. <clears throat> what do you think about Sword of the Troll? Uh he's funny. He's funny. His fans are fucking kind of annoying. <laughs> I kinda stopped watching him though, like well if I watch him I have to turn off the live chat. I have to just turn off that live chat. It's just fucking cringe. Fucking cringe. These people are like worshipping him. Yeah, he's funny, but goddamn, like get off his dick. <laughs> like there was this one dude, like I got into a spat with him on the live chat. Like we started getting back and forth on it, and then all his buddies started like coming after me. It's like this dude, he keeps like donating an ass load of money to this guy. It's like, bro, you're simping over a Japanese dude. Like it's one thing if you're gonna be simping over a hot chick with boobs. But like, there's like a dude simping over another dude. I don't know, man. It's like, he just like, he keeps sending like all this fucking money, like tons of fucking money. And then bragging about it. It's like, dude, do your parents know that you took their credit card? <laughs> oh, man. I'm being a hater because he might actually have a lot of money. Who knows? But I think someone who spends that much money in donations on another guy that they don't know probably didn't work hard for that money they probably uh have rich parents probably nobita uh I, no, i'm not talking about nobita but i fucking hate that guy too he's the fucking worst he's the absolute dog shit <laughs> just the drizzling shit i can't stand that guy um but uh yeah no there's this one called ryu react he's just like this reaction channel and I don't know how many subs he's got, 50, 60, 1,000 subs. And he uploads multiple times a day. It's pretty insane. You know how these reaction channels are. They, they really spam the, up, the daily uploads. I think there's a limit to how many times a day you can upload. So I think, I think he goes with the limit. Because otherwise YouTube would say, nah, don't do that. What the hell's his name? Uh, da, 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 da. I don't even know what his name is because he changed it like one time. Okay, that's a Japanese chick. What the fuck is his name? A uh, Ryu Japan, dude. He's changed it like three fucking times. One hundred fifteen thousand subscribers. Jesus Christ, I'm saying his name forty fifty. Two hundred seventy one videos. Jesus fucking Christ. This guy reacts to like the history of Japan, filthy Frank kind of stuff. Uh, he'll react to like a uh, Family Guy, like a, a compilation video of Family Guy making lots of like Asian stereotype jokes. And he he either a doesn't get the joke, so he's just like slack jawed like a moron, like Duh. or he like looks like he's clearly offended, you know? And he's just like that. It, it, or then he'll sit there and he'll start getting like. I, I understand that it's a joke, and I, I, I understand that people find it funny, but I, 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 I don't know about that one. Uh, and you can clearly tell that he's just having, like, an autistic fucking fit. <laughs> he's like, oh, he's like, it's like, it's like, bro, you don't, you don't get the joke most of the time. It goes way over your head, and a lot of times you're also, like, really offended about stuff that's just, like, super minor. Like, uh... He's the type of Japanese person that would get really offended by Asian stereotypes. Like, uh, boy. Like, I don't really see a lot of that. Like, I, I think most, uh, most Asian people I meet, uh, are aware of the stereotypes and they sort of just take it like, ha ha ha, yeah, ha ha ha, oh yeah, white people. Guys, uh, white people, and they, you know, there's jokes about white people, so, you know, I take it. But there are some Asian people that get really upset about that shit. I remember there was a video of, like, some guy in Korea. He went to South Korea, and he showed Korean people, young young Korean people on the streets, uh, fa the family guy stuff, where they were making that episode where they were, like, sort of poking fun at Korean culture and K-pop and that kind of stuff. And they were getting upset. And there was even a Korean girl that was literally like angry and she had like tears in her eyes. She was like, you don't joke about that. I'm so upset right now. How could they do this? They're so rude. And I'm just like, oh gosh. Sensitive culture. <laughs> oh man. Shannon Nami. Uh, 
I haven't watched their videos, honestly. I'm sure it's not that great. Um, I've seen some of them. She seems okay. She, she, seems, she seems okay. I'm sure she's nice, but that's not really my type of thing. He has only uploaded once in a couple months. Who are you talking about? The Ryu, the Ryu Japan guy? Nah, because that guy uploads every day. Oh, oh! You're right! He stopped uploading a couple months ago, but he uploaded something a day ago. Oh wow, he took like a two month break, maybe. Huh. Wonder what's up that- wonder what that's all about. Hmm. Huh. I guess he has- I guess he sort of has slowed down even before that. I'm scrolling through and seeing that there's less- I don't know, I just remember seeing his shit in the recommended all the time. Like, spammy as hell. Super spammy. What the fuck? Look at his view count dramatically drop. Well, yeah, because it's not- it's- it's low-hanging fruit. It's low-hanging fruit. And again, so is, uh, so is drinking on camera and talking shit about other people. The irony is not lost on me. <laughs> uh, I don't even know how this topic even came up. I don't go out of my way to talk shit about other people, but, uh, you know, I'm talking shit about people who have a crazy amount of subscribers and they're never going to know who I am anyways. So they can take it. I'm sure they get lots of nasty comments on a daily basis, so... Whatever I have to say about them has already been said by countless people, and they probably are fully aware of it, so... And they're never gonna know I said it, so who gives a shit? And even if they did, what are they gonna fucking do about it? He gets offended by Family Guy jokes. Obviously, he's not that tough. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, well. You aren't being malicious. Oh man, I don't know. It could be. It could be viewed. It's. It's all about perspective. It could be viewed as malicious by people who say that I have no reason to name drop people or even say anything negative. More like if you don't like it, don't watch it. You know that kind of thing. Or if you don't like somebody, then just ignore them. I don't even know how the topic even came up at all. Like honestly, did I bring it up, or was there something in the comments, or something like that? Hmm. Oh, it was the Uncle Roger thing. Nice. What the hell's that? Oh, it's that plastic thing. I get a freaking canker sore deep in my mouth, so I put these, like, patches on there to heal it up. And then it, like, sort of, it sort of dissolves after a while, but then there's, like, a little plastic film left behind. Pretty stupid. You keep forgetting to shop. Oh well, now's your chance because I'm about to I'm about to end this stream and then maybe wait like ten minutes and then start the uh, Yakuza Five stream. So I don't I don't know how long it would take you if if it's one of those things where you got to get in a car or something or if it's something where it's like in your neighborhood and you're just like oh bloop, bloop. you know I don't know if it's like bad or not. All right, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end the stream anyway because uh... what cat. What? Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, bud. Come here. Don't do that. If you're gonna whine at the door, then come in here. Don't stand there at the door and whine. It'll be ten minutes top. Nice. Come on. I suck. Can you just stop? Fuck you. What an asshole. <laughs> what an asshole. If you're gonna... What? What is that? What is that? <laughs> hey, 
He has the most, like, unique fucking sounds I've ever heard. He'll make the weirdest sounds all the time. He's dumb. What? Do you need food again? Fat piece of shit. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, well I'm gonna end the fucking stream. Go feed the cat. I assume he wants food. Always eating all the time. I have to deal with this shit every day. Alright, I'll see you guys like in 10 minutes when I start the next stream, the Yakuza stream. It's, uh, the link is shared in the Discord. And, uh, yeah, thanks for checking this out. I will see you soon.